Let's talk about books, baby. Hi, everybody. Welcome to another episode of Final Orders Due. When are orders due? Orders are due on Sunday, March 7th at noon Eastern time. Noon Standard Time. Noon Eastern Time. What do I say? Noon. <sighs> if you're a subscriber to Richmond Comics, you are probably on Eastern Time. Probably. Odds are. But still. But still. Standard Eastern time. Don't forget. Times of the Eastern zone. Now you're just making stuff up. I am just making stuff up. There we go. First up, we have Shadecraft number one. This girl is afraid of her shadow. I'm being for real. Yeah, yeah, well, it, it looks happens. really cool. It does. From image. That means it's probably good. They seem to be going more to the mature and horror realm of things yeah, here lately. A lot of books. A lot of books seem to be heading that way lately. Seems but to still. Be. So but she's adorable. Yeah, she's a teenager, it says. Right there. She's a teenager. All right. Anyway, moving on. And everyone is tulips is a trade, or I don't know if it was single issues, if it's just a graphic novel, not sure. But, internet viral superstar. Just kidding. Maybe not. But. She dropped her phone. Yeah. She does go viral overnight. And then you kind of learn that that's not all it's cracked up to be. So, maybe more people should read this. Oh, maybe. Anyway. I'm excited about it. Yep. And it comes out in June. So. Advanced Vanced. Solicit. Advanced FOC. I think it was just in the last break. It was. Was. And so is this. Yeah, so is this. If you turned in your last previews, you might have just turned this in, but if not, it's now on FOC for June. It's the Madman Library Edition hardcover. So basically, uh, Dark Horse is getting ready to basically put all the Madman stories into a few hardcovers. So join Mike Aldred and Laura Aldred as they and Han as they go through. The entire Madman catalog. So this is be in stores for June 9th for a hundred bucks. And if you're a fan of Madman, you should check out their Kickstarters because our good friend at Geek Gear has been making some really cool key pops for them. So support her, please. Right, yeah. And thank you. Yep. Chris Irving does some really good uh Kickstarters for Madman swag. Um Got some yo-yos. Yeah, we'll be we got we'll, some patches and pins or something. And we'll have some of the balsa planes for some uh balsa wood gliders, probably as some giveaways if you if you order a Madman library edition hardcover, you may get a balsa wood fly. Not, Not may, you probably will. Kickstarter related, <laughs> no. but Philip has a uh, skateboard that he's been threatening to hang up at the shop. Yeah, it's probably um, gonna just stay home. And also, if you want to be freaked out, you should tell him to wear his Madman costume one day. <laughs> that would freak him out. He's a little fanboy, if you didn't know. I don't know what you're talking about. I have no idea yeah. what you're talking about. Maybe Batman will wear the Madman costume one day. <laughs> ah, anyway. <clears throat> anyway, if you want this omnibus, let us know. FOC is Sunday at noon. I'm sorry, I'm just rambling. Easter standard. I know, you're taking my role. Really weird. Huh like we're the same person and then for marvel we kick off curses man things 50th anniversary so we have avengers curse man thing number one uh it's part one of three and so we start this off at the end of march so it should be pretty interesting as we deal more with the nexus Ooh. and spoiler alert why is this spoiler alert they mentioned uh, that's true. Nexus, the Nexus is mentioned. If anyone watches WandaVision, it's there. If you're not, you should. I'm so excited. I'm going to sit back on this one and just... Silk is my favorite girl in the Marvel world. So, she's getting a new series. This is one of the covers. All of the covers, however, are very beautiful. We'll show another one here soon. But... You should get on this because it's going to be amazing. That's all I have to say. You should buy Silk because it's amazing. It's written by a Korean-American creator, right? 
So it's going to be like own voices, but superhero. Is it's a five thing? issue series. Is that a thing? So, yeah. So it's a five issue series. First issue is, comes out in March. This is the main cover. So, yep. This is that. cover A. So, but there's, there's lots like of five cool covers. covers. Yep. Something like that. So that's uh, another cover. These are all the Jen Bartel variants for Women's History Month. So we have King of Black Ghost Rider number one for Kushala. Yes. Sorry. That's correct. Cindy Moon for Silk number one. Emma Frost is on X-Men number 19. Yes, that's correct. And then Black Cat or Felicia Hardy is on Black Cat number four. Four, yeah. So get those pre-orders in for those books. They're on FOC. Beautiful. So, yeah, once again, all the Jen Bartel books are always beautiful. So She's just insanely yeah. talented. And if you did miss the one, uh, She-Hulk came out this week. So the She-Hulk cover came out Wednesday. So I think we still have a couple of those at the shop. So run she in there and get them now. Incredible. Yes. Incredible. Incredible leg. And then next up from Boom is Power Rangers Unlimited, Air to Darkness, number one. So it's a one shot. Um, that's why it's $8. Um, but they'll be, basically it's a one shot about a, I don't remember her name. Um, all I know uh, is this cover is creepy cool. Like she. Astronomer, sorry. Looks awesome. Yeah, so. Basically, Astronomer was a villain, and she became a ranger, so this is kind of, they're finally going to tell her origin from that series, so. She looks cool. Yep, yeah, it'd be really cool. This is a, the main cover, which is a Dan Moore cover, so. So you should get that, y'all. Yep. Witchblood number one. From Vault. It looks pretty cool. This one also has some really cool covers. That's um, a tarot card cover. That's really I cool. Think on this cov one. Yeah, cover B looks like a tarot card, and cover C looks like an homage to Marvel with their little circles. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if you've ever seen any of the vault books we get in the shop, they usually do kind of a one cover that's kind of a throwback to the 70s, late 70s covers that Marvel used to do. This is probably an homage to something. I just don't know what it is. Yeah, probably not. But it's biker vampires. What can go wrong? <laughs> Everything. Everything, Everything can, go can go wrong. So, I like all the witchy vibes here. And then just announced, <laughs> literally, literally last week was there's a Batman Fortnite Fortnite zero point number one, and it is actually on FOC on Sunday for April twentieth. So, like I said, it was just literally just announced. So, if you really want orders for that, then you need to get those orders in pretty quick. I think this is a six issue series six issue mini series that they're doing. So be prepared for that as it's Fortnite. People love Fortnite. People do love Fortnite. And in stores, hey, April 20th. I think I said four nine nine. Hey. And that's all folks. Except for the date's still wrong. That wasn't on me. That is a hundred percent on me and I thought I changed it, but remember this crashed. When I was finishing up, so I, bet. Excuse to me. I have lots of them. There we go. So, final orders are due on the 7th of March. Beware the eyes of March. We're not there yet. Oh, sorry. You're okay. skipping ahead. Oh, all right. We'll talk about that next weekend. Okay, sorry. I tried. Beware. <laughs> all Anywho. right. Lots of stuff. Go check out the links that are attached for Previews World Final Order Cutoff and Lunar Distribution uh, FOC. So go check those out. Find lots and lots of books. Send them in by Sunday so we can get them done. And if they are not in by Sunday around noon, um, it's a little bit harder for us to guarantee books, depending on especially some of the low, low order to low, lower print run books. So, just saying. And come in and get your Berserkers oh, and my. your Giant Days X-Men and your Noctaras because we have plenty. Giant Days X-Men. You want to try that again? <laughs> <clears throat> come get your Berserkers and your Demon Days X-Men and your Noctara because we have plenty. Yep. 
So thanks everybody. Did I really say giant days? You did. You said giant days. Actually. Oh, you can come get your giant you days. Go get too. giant days too. Actually, we have the full run. Yeah, giant days is actually a really good book. If you've never read giant days, it's over on the young adult side. By boom, it's really good. So anyway, thanks a lot. Have a good night, day, sometime. Whenever you watch this, whenever you watch it, I hope it's all great. I hope you watched. And just that too. So thanks a lot. Bye. Stay safe.